I now call upon the student representative, Coyote Damali, to respond on behalf of the student body. Coyote. Um, Chancellor, Vice Chancellor, fellow graduates, family and friends. As Vice President over the last 12 months, I'm absolutely honoured to be here today to deliver the student vote of thanks. And graduates, I know you guys have benefited so much here from your time at MMU. And I think that a graduation ceremony like this is a wonderful climax to the end of your academic career. Well, some of you guys are thinking, you know what? I didn't mind waiting three hours to see a proud four second moment of my kid. But really and truthfully, it's only you guys down below who actually know all the hard work, effort and sacrifice that you actually did. Like I'm talking about those late night shifts in Brock, then rushing in the morning to hand in your work to that blue bin in the SIP. Let us give thanks for all of our different academic as well as non-academic university staff who've worked hard non-stop around the clock to help each and every single one of you guys along your MMU paths. So, you know, so as alumni, make sure you keep in touch because they really appreciate that. But despite them sometimes setting you work that made you feel like you was kept under pressure, the fact that all of you guys are here today suggests that you've been able to battle, persist and thrive through the stormy weather. So for that today you've been rewarded with your degree so now you can leave this room, go out there and make your lives better. But before you do, like a wedding, let's all be gathered here together. To never forget, but to always remember. Not everybody's going to like you. Because no matter what you do, not everybody's going to like you. So let's take the one in five rule for example. That means that out of five people, one is going to love you. They'll be your ride or die. They'll be with you by your side. The other one is just going to hate you. And there's nothing you can do about it. And the final three, they'll be neutral and might not necessarily have an opinion. Because no matter what you do, not everybody's going to like you. So let's look at the UK population of roughly 60 million. That means that 12 million people are just going to hate you, period. The next 36 million won't necessarily have an opinion and the final 12 million, they'll be the ones who love you, they'll be the ones who will care about you. So just remember that no matter what you do, no matter what you do, not to everybody is going to like you. Our class of 14, like those before us, you guys can now also scream the words MMU Cheshire. It's been a pleasure.